Hello my legends, it's your boy Link and today we're opening 10 Walking Dead mystery figures from McFarlane. Hello my legends, welcome back to the channel. I hope you're having a wonderful day today. It is your boy Link with more collectibles, I guess we call them. Um, as you'll all know, I've recently been catching up on The Walking Dead. Um, I've recently been reading the comics. I have read um, about the first 20 comics at this point. I have seen all the series now. Um, but basically, these are based on the AMC show, which is why it says AMC The Walking Dead instead of just The Walking Dead. If it doesn't say AMC, it's normally um, based on the comics, not the show. So I've got 10 of these on eBay for £9. So less than a quid each for these. Uh, on the back is all the different people that are in there. There's like a Walker, Daryl, someone I don't know, Michonne, bunch of different people, even Abraham, I think, yeah. No sign of Glenn just yet, and also no sign of my mate Negan. Um, this may predate Negan, perhaps. So that might be why you can't get Negan. Um, it says it's series three. I don't know what that really means. Um, and it also says Walking Dead construction sets. I've got no idea what they are. So let me know if you know what they are. But I like the Walking Dead. I've been buying the pots. And I saw these mystery figures on eBay. And I just thought, let's get some and see what they like. So I can't open it. I bet I can now. Right, here we go. This is bag one. We really want Negan, if he's in there. Glenn. Daryl. Ooh. It's like Lego. What the hell? It looks like you have to build them. Okay. So you can get the van. They're called Walking Dead Construction. It says it looks like there's like... Knockoff Lego made by McFarlane. McFarlane are like known for being like a statue maker and like a figures maker. They make like really high quality stuff. Like they used to make like Terminator figures, um, which is one of the ones that I sort of remember people having. But yeah, you can get the vehicles and like the prison cells and stuff. Okay, so it doesn't really tell you who there is. Uh, there's five piece figures and seven piece figures. Um. Okay, so the five-piece figure has the legs connected already. It also says you can win a $1,500 shopping spree, which I, I I don't think I can win because I'm in the UK. So we got Daryl anyway. So let's get him. Oh, these things are weird. They've got like big heads. So you get like a nice little base, but it's got Lego on. It's got like a Lego. The head sculpt's actually quite nice. It's, it's weird, I'll be honest with you. They're weird. I don't know how I feel about them. It's a bit janky. <laughs> it's a little bit like... Daryl's a little bit... Like, weird, basically. They're fiddly as well to put together. Let's get his arms on. They're nice, though. They're nice quality. For a blind... His arm doesn't want to go in. Daryl, you need an arm. How are you gonna fight off walkers with no arm? His arm will not go in. That is an L, not a dub. Let's try his other arm. Okay, his other arm. So this arm's going in really good. This arm. Took a whole joint space where it doesn't wanna go in. I've dropped it. That was Taken after his brother. If you know, you know. If you if you don't know The Walking Dead, this um, video will have references that aren't for you, but I can't get it in. Like, no matter how hard I push, it doesn't go in. All right, he's got like a little hook on the foot. So you then hook him onto this base, I guess, somehow, like this. It's weird. It is weird. And then he has a little crossbow, which doesn't actually fit in his hands. 
So I feel like you got to rest it in his hands. That doesn't go in at all. But yeah, it's not great. Because like the, the crossbow is too big for his hands. There we go. Daryl Dixon. I don't know what I'm gonna do with these. Um I'll probably give any cool dupes to my niece because she likes the walking dead. Um who do we have here? We have another bloody Daryl. There's no point building another one, is there? Let's see who's next. Hopefully this isn't one of their mystery bags where you can weigh them and I've been like scammed. Next up we have Daryl. I'm scared. I think I've been conned by eBay. Like mystery minifigures, and they've weighed them all, and they're all Daryl. Maybe Daryl's the one that's not worth money. No, they're not like that. It's Rick. I don't know what season Rick this is from. If anyone can work that out once I build him, do let me know in those comments down below. Um, I'm making a mess here. This is really like a... The problem with blind bags is there's so much plastic. Like unnecessary levels of plastic, basically. Um, so Rick is also one of the ones where his legs just, he's lost his body now. They're so tiny and fiddly. I thought they were going to be a little bit bigger than that. But they are tiny little guys. He's facing that way. Jeez, that arm goes there. Okay, his arms are going in nice. Well, I said that before I put both arms in. Does Rick not have a weapon? Doesn't look like Rick comes with a weapon. Why is the head sculpt so big? Like, it doesn't look good. It looks like... He has got a slightly different base to Daryl, but it's still like a concrete type one. But yeah, the heads are just too big for the characters, basically. And where the neck joint is just like a turn, not a lean, he looks like he's like looking at the floor, basically. Do you see what I mean? Like he's looking down a little bit. And he's also got a, a very pronounced lean. You know? A bit weird. Okay, so we didn't get all Daryls. That's good. Who's next? Come on, where's Negan? I'm just joking, it's actually another Daryl. I am getting plastic everywhere. Okay, we got another Rick. So that's how many doubles. We've literally opened one, two, three, four, five. So there should be five left. No, there's three there. Huh? Four. Oh, no, there's... I'm so confused here. So there's one, two, three, four. Five, six. Okay, I've, I wasn't counting the ones that already built. So we've got four left. Please be someone that isn't Daryl. Like, if I was going to get dupes as well, I would have liked dupe walkers. Do you know what I mean? Like, if you're going to get dupes, like walkers, you can set up like a whole, like, oh, that's another Daryl. This is a joke. Like, I don't even get it. Oh, it's another Daryl. They're having a laugh with me now. That's like five Daryls. There's only two left. To try and get someone that isn't Daryl. Or... I guess Daryl and Rick can stay together, but... um, That looks... Oh, no, it's Daryl again. This is taking the mickey. I'm going to be honest with you. I'm not happy. I've been scammed. And then last but not least... Fucking Daryl. It actually says Loot Crate exclusive. I wonder if it's like a promo thing in Loot Crate. And that's why it's so bad. So just to recap. We got eight doubles. We only got Rick and Daryl. We didn't get anyone else. But of them, one, two, three, 
four, five, six, seven of them. Eight of them were Daryl's. What a joke. Hopefully you've enjoyed this video. If you want to see me do more mystery figures, please comment down below with mystery figures that you think would be a cool unboxing video. And um, I'll unbox some and hopefully get something more interesting than that. Also, if anyone knows where I could get these but not loot crate bags, let me know in the comments. All that's left to say is give the video a thumbs up if you enjoyed yourself. Comment down below with what you think of The Walking Dead. Do you think I got scammed? Do you think I should be annoyed? Should I be happy with these two guys for nine quid? Um, I guess I might have paid a fiver for two little statues of these guys. So the fact that I can give my niece one of each, I'm trying to justify it myself, but it's not good, is it? They can stand and they can look after my computer. But all this is to say, I've been Link, you've been my legends. Thank you so much for watching this, and I'll see you all real soon. Thanks so much for watching today, guys. If you've enjoyed that, you can click up here, and you can watch another video of mine. Or if you really love it, if you really, really love it, or even if you just like it a little bit, go down here and subscribe to the channel. It means you'll never, ever miss what is coming up real soon.